you know, this, this whole culture of putting up these perfect pictures, um, I, I think, like, I'm bored of seeing that. If I see another picture like that, I'd want to unfollow the account because I feel there's just too much, I don't know, I find, like, imperfections or you want to see something more relatable. Yeah. Um, also, that's why I said, I think you need to, in a day, the first thing you do in the morning cannot be waking up and going on social media. That's, I think, great. I feel, point. give yourself that one hour. That's what I do. When I wake up, my first one hour, I, I try not even looking at my phone, even though I know I have to, like, attend to work calls, and that's probably the only reason why I would, because in my job, we don't have timings. But I still make that one hour for myself, whether I want to meditate, read a book, which I'm trying to do for very long, um, I, whether I want to you know, just have my breakfast, then go to the gym, do, like, have a routine, have a certain structure in your life, just for yourself. And I feel when you realize how much that will help you grow as a person, keep your, you know, what I noticed when, when I started doing this is that whether it's anxiety, fear, um, all these emotions, all these negative emotions, sometimes creep in the way even when you're just scrolling and you don't realize it. It's so subconscious. But if I had to remove that and my first one hour of my day was not, you know, it did not start like that, you just realize how much more enriched you are, how much more um, present you are, um, you know, and taking in this moment. And you're, I think it just lays that foundation for the rest of your day.